do punks put in the, my backpack? This is what I put in. Yeah, half the size of, of or a third of the size, size of what Holberg put in. Holberg had no problem to putting about a four pound rock in my backpack. <laughs> I didn't happen to have my backpack with me. Yeah, because you didn't bring shit yesterday oh, other than the clothes cool. on your back. Thank you. And a wallet I and your phone. You didn't even bring a charger. You didn't even bring a charger. And I was the most equipped to deal with this hike. <laughs> Were you though? What? I, I had the water shoes, dude. That you keep saying are gay. I'm not saying they're. I'm not uh, homophobic. I'm I didn't you say you're homophobic, but you just say they look gay. Did I'm he not? Good. Yeah, he did. Yes, say. he did. Yes, he did. Yeah. So I got to lug a couple of rocks up here. Yeah, because I'm the only one that brought a backpack. Oh, and who lugged all the beer down there? Me? Uh, Moi. Thank you. Yeah. What was that again? Thank you. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. I'm the guy. I'm the guy. I'm that guy. You you drive. We appreciate you, Corey. You yeah. drive, and you did get the code to get back in here. Jeff bought us some Pizza Hut last night. Thank you. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, but you're just glossing over all the intangibles I bring to the table. <laughs> the, he's inspirational. This man is completely inspirational. Without him, there is no there's no there's tree. No tree. Half the fun. But of course, without me, you don't know about all these trees. So it's kind of a yin and yang. We need each other. Ooh. We need yes. Each other. Yes. Oh, successful trip. Now we got to get the hell out of here. We're six miles back out to the Bald Hills Road. And yeah, then we're heading to Wichapec, yeah. where apparently there's a fine dining establishment there in Wichapec. <laughs> I didn't say that. But there might be. But don't hold me if it's not there, it's going to be in Happy Camp. There's going to be a great place for us to eat and celebrate what we've done the last couple of days. Well, you can always say you went to Winterpeck and Happy Camp. Yeah. We, a lot of people can say that. Corey, not we can put that can. feather in our cap. Not a lot of people before. can say that, man. I haven't been there lately, but I've been there before. A feather in our cap. Because I've been almost everywhere in Northern California. and Winterpeck's the I, most wild I've place. I've been there. It's the most wild camp. place you've I been, been to. I've been to Wichapec, but not Happy Camp. <laughs> no, I've never been to Happy Camp either. So, from what I understand, a huge fire ripped through there last year, so it, it may not be that nice, but we can check it out. we got a lot of driving ahead of us. Thanks, Corey. Yeah, I have a lot of driving ahead of us. <laughs> no cops that way, though, I'm sure. You can no. drive as fast as you want. Yep. In fact, you won't see another car on the road. No, I didn't when I went. <laughs> You're mocking me, but I'm telling you, man. From like miles down Bald Hill, Bald Hills to the to Wichapack, I'd never seen a car. Yeah. I don't think maybe one. Painted horses. I I might have seen. I don't. That was a while ago. Okay. Maybe some painted horses, but no cars.